somebody had a question here related to that. If you start on tier two, you can stay on it for that. Great question. I get this question. I've got this question throughout my 12 plus years in this business. John, if I stay TRT, am I going to have to do it forever? I don't want to do this forever. How's this going to work? So when you start TRT, you don't have to stay on it forever. Okay. But if you want to get off, there's a way to get off. And when you do get off, your levels aren't going to be where they were when you were taking testosterone. So it's going to come down because there's nothing that recharges the testicles to start producing testosterone like it used to. If we had something like that, we would not need places like me for TRT. We can just do peptides and weight loss and we can recharge your, your own gonads and you'd be ready to rock and roll, but that doesn't happen. So that's where you need to see on TRT forever. The forever is if, if you want to feel like that the whole time, then you're going to stay on it. It's kind of like somebody that goes on cholesterol medication. If they can't get their cholesterol down naturally, and they need to be on the medication, and they don't take the medication, their cholesterol is going to be up and that can have an effect. Blood pressure, whatever it is. So it's the exact same thing. So if you want to have those levels and you want to feel good like that, then you need to be on testosterone. If for some reason, let's say you get prostate cancer and you need to come off testosterone, there's a way to get off and you're not going to feel like you did when you're on testosterone, but we can hopefully help you not crash your levels because that's when people start feeling bad. People start feeling bad when they are on testosterone and then they just go cold turkey. You go cold turkey, your levels are going to go here to here. And you're going to feel it, not only physically, but mentally too as well. So, you know, at that point, you know, listen, TRT is a great thing for people that need it. If you don't need it, don't start it. When you do need it, you're going to need it. And when you do need it, you're going to feel better when you take it. So, that's that's the advice that I would say. And there's no reason for you to want to get off of it unless, like I said, maybe it's a financial thing or maybe it's a health thing. But I'll, I'll tell you this much. I think, and you know, a lot of people out there probably wouldn't agree, but you know, our clinic, you know, for my dad, like he was on testosterone the whole time, he was on cancer treatments. And I think that that saved his ass from dwindling down to nothing. So at that point, like, I think there's some big benefits to being on testosterone if you need it. Um, and at that point, I would say, if you don't need it, don't start it, but you don't need to be on it forever. But uh, if you want to feel like that, you're, you're going to have to take it. Uh, I'm on me. Okay. Hey, Johnny. At some time, I would love to talk about cholesterol medicine. 